one of the co-artistic directors at Paper Work Theatre. We make work which is full of joy, adventure and human experiments. This video is all about bringing your story to life using drama. Firstly, decide what story you want to tell. What do you want to say? What is the message in your play? This is known as the theme. The famous Liverpudlian playwright and screenwriter Willie Russell said to write a play one must passionately believe in something which one wants to communicate. Some writers use me maps like this. Yeah, no, I can't draw. Draw a stick person. That person represents you. And then around the outside of the person, list your influences. They could be favourite films or books or childhood memories. When we are writing, we draw on our life experiences. Take a look at your me map. What sparks an idea? Next, develop the character or characters. Who tells your story? Give your character a name, an age, what is their nationality and gender. You might also want to give them a job, think about their qualifications, place them in a relationship or describe some of their physical features. As well as thinking about your character's personality, attitudes and emotional responses throughout the play. Think about their background. What happened before the play begun? Does this change the story in any way? Now you can develop the plot. That's the stuff we're going to see on stage. The plot is made up of events. They're usually actions like the characters kissing one another or meeting a long lost relative for the first time. Sometimes they're more subtle, like the character crying alone. And remember, all stories have a beginning, a middle and an end. Now it's time to put pen to paper. Writing drama is not the same as writing a novel. You'll be writing dialogue instead of prose. Think about someone you know really well. What phrases do they say? What slang do they use? Now think about your character and what they might say. Once you've got your story, you'll want to think about staging it in a theatrical way. You might like to use dramatic devices such as music. Or use a narrator. Marley was dead to begin with. The unique thing about drama is that there is a live audience well, most of the time. Think about what you want your audience to feel when listening to your story. What do you want them to think about afterwards? And that's it. They are my top tips for bringing your story to life through drama. Good luck and happy storytelling.